Today we're gonna make this beautiful paper plane very easy. It's my first audio tutorial. First of all, we're going to use an A4 paper. It's a craft sugar paper, very light, durable. So you can see we fold first, fold it in half. Make sure you line it up correctly. Use your fingers at the bottom. That's it. Once you're happy with the crease, just press down the edges and create that nice sharp edge. And a sharp the blade. Next up and then we fold the top into a triangle and once you're happy with the crease you have you line it up straight and you press hard onto the edge next we do the same to the other side then we will fold it onto itself make sure you light it up so it's dead in the middle once you're happy just press down and create that sharp crease do the same for the other side by the way if I'm going too quickly you can always pause it and take it back and rewind in a slow motion. We flip it over to the other side and we bring the tip of the triangle and we're going to try to touch the bottom of the edge of the paper. Make sure it's lined up correctly. Use that as a reference point. Once you're happy, press down to the edge. Flip it to the other side. Make sure you press down onto the creases. As you can see, I'm going to pick up from that edge there. I'm going to bring it down. And I'm going to try to fold it upon itself. And just be patient with this. And you just carefully, carefully bend the paper. Don't create a crease yet. Once you have lined it up, then press down and create that nice sharp edge. And it will look nice and neat. And we'll do the same for the other side. Right there, right in the middle. Once you're happy, press down just like that. Next, we're going to fold the triangle. So, the triangle that was uh, touching the base as a reference point, we're going to lift it up. Lift it up and we're going to try to use the tip as a reference point. As you can see, and once you have that lined up, you can press down hard and it should look very good. Very symmetrical. As you can see, next we're going to fold using that crease as a reference point we're going to fold it down just like that very easy
as you can see I do take time to press down to the crease now we fold it like a book and if you have all those measurements done correctly it shouldn't be a problem it should, it should uh, close very easily as you can see now I'm just pressing down those edges just making a sharp crease because the crease is uh, the key thing guys that's what makes the plane actually fly and glides through the air now by using your finger we're going to start to fold right to the tip you've got to be patient with this so you zoom in so you guys can see what I'm doing there you go as you can see I'm not even putting any creases yet just folding it just to make sure it's lined up and once I'm happy I then apply the crease and I'll do the same for the other side very easy and once you have the crease you do apply pressure create that sharp crease don't forget to press the notification bell for more videos up in your hands get a feel see how it's looking so far I'm very pleased with this design very easy I know some of my viewers have said oh this is so complicated your fingers is in the way so I've decided to make this tutorial to make it simplified and uh, easy for you to follow and there you go guys thank you very much for watching make sure you smash the like button Subscribe to the channel to see more videos just like this.